The issue is, in our bedroom, which we were just in just then, I just don't know how to organize this. No! Okay, plan B. That was too exciting. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Saturday, um, our move-in day, well, our move-out day was meant to be yesterday, but there was a whole complication with them approving us late, so then we're able to move out on Monday, and we get electricity at our new house on Monday, so we can't exactly move there yet. So we're gonna kind of, like, get rid of all this, like, stuff on the floor today, and, like, in all the other rooms as well, and move the fridge. I'm gonna empty the fridge, put it in this esky that Michael just bought. We needed an esky anyway for like camping and stuff and fishing, I guess. <laughs> and so I'm just going to unpack the fridge. Oh, and then tomorrow, tomorrow we're going to do like the whole like deep cleaning, bond clean type of thing. Today is purely just get everything out of the house day. Let's get the stuff out of the fridge. Um, are you able to lift the esky in front of the fridge so I can like easily put it in? Sure. Could you help me? It's not that heavy. It's just awkward. It's going to be heavy. Yeah, it's going to be so heavy. <laughs> their cars they're at the new house right now I'm just going to come now and I've put my flowers at the front seat they get a little they get a little special front seat row <laughs> um they're all my dried flowers not all of them I have a box of dried flowers as well but I'm gonna go to the new house now and I guess unpack this car and there's still some stuff inside our old house but not not much left and then we're gonna clean tomorrow <laughs> so we're back from eating i forgot to film but we have cleaned all the walls and <laughs> we have to clean the bathroom and we've got to clean the kitchen now michael's cleaned the oven and the front of the cupboards. So I've just got to clean like in the drawers sort of thing. And then under here, which is really dirty. Yeah. And then after, um, after we do that, we got to mop the floors, or vacuum the floors, mop the floors. And then we got to clean the rest of the windows. And then we got to mow. 
but I think Michael's gonna do that on another day. Um, and that's it. That's it, right? Oh, we're gonna fix a lock in the bathroom door. And I got a list. Oops, snip. Patch holes. Okay, I can do that now. So, Evie made a lovely little hole in the wall. That's right here. Yeah. Um, she fell on Michael's drum kit and then it made a dent in the wall. So, I'm gonna patch up that and then paint it. I think there's a paint can here. Hopefully it's the right color. And then we'll be finally done. And then we have to go clean our other house because it's not cleaned very well. And then unpack that house. Long process, long process. I'm home alone um, and the house is messy because we have officially moved in. But it's so messy. Oh my goodness, okay. The issue is in our bedroom, which we were just in just then, um, this closet, it has shelves for your folded clothes on each side, which is brilliant. And it has it on this side. So his and hers, you know what I mean? But in here, there's only a limited amount of hanging space. In the other house, we had a whole rod across the whole entire wardrobe. We didn't have any folded space, so we had we had drawers underneath. There's like only limited amount of hanging space on either side of the wardrobe, which isn't enough. This is all of Michael's clothes, or hanging clothes. There might be a few more like that needs to be cleaned. I need a little bit more hanging space than he does. And originally I said, oh yeah, you can have the closet in our bedroom, but in this um, bedroom, but it's actually, it's actually out my DIY room. I was gonna have my clothes in here. This closet is actually smaller. So the hanging space here is smaller than the other one. In order to fit all that and that, Comfortably, I kind of think that Michael should have this wardrobe and I should have this one in here. So I'm gonna switch them. Hopefully, he doesn't mind. I popped my clothes in here. <laughs> it just fits. The shelves here are so high. And I just feel like this is wasted space up here. And it's like all the way down. I kind of want to see if there's some sort of way that I can organize like shelving cubes. Like do you have like, like a little tray thing that sits here and then you put more on top? I wonder if there's like a certain way you can organize that because... I just feel like it's wasted space and I want to see if there's like a better way to because if there is I can put my shoes at the bottom one. I'll probably have to go to Ikea to get some like things and inspiration. Might look it up and see what I can do about that and maybe put it in the vlog. Good morning. It's the next day. Um, I've been looking at my closet and I kind of miss having drawers. I used to have like my clothes all folded into drawers. Honestly, it's like not displayed as nice and I don't really like it. I just don't know how to organize this because like that stack is so high I don't know if I like having to reach under all that to get my jeans and then that stack is like my my nice pants and then my like at home pants and I don't want them to be together <sighs> this one is my like graphic tees and stuff and then these are like my like nicer tops these back here which you can't even see I like all my like basic whites and stuff like that. So it's like I can't even access these and I haven't even put all my home clothes. Those are all my home clothes. These are, I don't know. I was able to fit them all like laid out nice in the drawers. But here it's just a little bit annoying. Like I almost want to have like a shelf 
an extra shelf here and put like all my like active wear and, and like homey clothes here. So then I have like all my nicer clothes here. It's just like, ah, I haven't even put my PJs here yet. I don't have many PJs, but I've got like my underwear and all that sort of stuff that has to go there as well. So I'm in a little bit of a dilemma because I'm kind of missing my drawers now. And like, I can put my drawers in there. I can do that, I think. Can I? I could. Maybe we should just do that. But what would go there? <gasps> my shoes. Okay, so now we're talking. That could work. I could, I could literally put my shoes here and like maybe some jumpers down there and then put oh my drawers there. That's so good. All right, I'm going to measure it. Measuring tape, measuring tape, measuring tape. Aha. Okay. Okay, let's see. So it comes up to here. Okay. 78 centimeters. So 78 centimeters. Okay, so it will come up to about here. Now, my jumpers will be dragging on it, but I dealt with that before. But at least I'll have a bit of room on the side for my dress, my long dresses. I do like that idea because then my shoes aren't all at the bottom here and I can't see them because my long dresses are covering them. And then I might wear my shoes more often because I literally wear three pairs of shoes. Okay, so 80 centimeters long around that. Um, no! Are you joking me? Oh. I thought I was on to something. So the mirror comes to here. That means I can't pull the drawers out. <sighs> okay, plan B. That was too exciting. All right, I'm gonna go to Ikea and to Kmart. We'll see what we can do about this. Or oh, I can take Michael's side over there. I can take this side as well. Because we do have more cupboard space than the other one, but I was gonna put my camera gear there. That seems so excessive though. It seems very excessive. Plan B. I'll see you at Ikea. Okay, so I've been organizing my pantry. I didn't show it in the vlog. I've been like Instagram storing it and I organized my fridge yesterday as well. So I finally have food in the fridge, which is nice. And um, so these are just like organized containers that I had before. Um, that's just stuff I put up on top there just then. But I bought some containers from Kmart just today. I bought these from Kmart. They were $8 each and they're just like nice and clear. So they go really, really well in pantries, which is fantastic. This is my spreads. These are my crackers and then I've got like some crumbs and <laughs> crumbs. What are they called? Panko crumbs? Panko bread crumbs, lasagna sheets and stuff like that. And then I've got baking and I'm gonna put my like other baking stuff like sugars and stuff like that. But I think that box is actually in this room, which I don't know why it got put in this room. Yes, here it is. What's in here? I think that's a flower. Sugar, it's empty. Um, oh dang, I need a whole new section. Cocoa powder, caster sugar, brown sugar. Nope, that's cereal. I can go there, move that. I've got to sort out that for yet. Uh, what's in here? Okay, these are all pastas. I don't know where I'm going to put them because I didn't make a space for them. Jeez, I have more food than I thought. Okay, I can put my pastas here. It's going to be stacked though. Hmm, I'm just going to have to do. All right. Oh, oh no. This is the second time this happened in this vlog. That's a lot of rice. Ah, dang it, I have to clean that up. That's as good as it's gonna get. I'm gonna put some labels on. Oh, I have to find them, they're in some sort of box. Um, and then up here, it's just the jamble, but it's okay because that's all I can do. That's it. Well, I hope you have enjoyed watching this vlog, this moving vlog. 
Um, I haven't worked out what my cupboard situation is yet. I'm going to talk to Michael to see if I can have his side. <laughs> Maybe <laughs> for, for my shoes and stuff. Make sure to subscribe because we have a lot, a lot of like styling and room transformations coming up on the Amelia and Bridie channel. But also like behind the scenes vlogs on this channel. So that's going to be fun. So subscribe to see more of the content of um, setting up my house. Yes, I'll see you later. Bye. Why'd I do that? Bye! <laughs>